Hello YouTube, this is Victor, your uh, flight attendant and also travel advisor. Today we're going to talk about connecting flights. Uh, let's say it's uh, winter and you would like to escape the snow, you're flying from Montreal to Cancun through Chicago and your flight out of Montreal is delayed. Is someone's going to look after you while you're in transit in Chicago? Well, watch this space. So welcome again, uh, if you haven't subscribed, it's a good time to do it. Just press the subscribe button, also you can click on the bell so every week with a new video you get notified and you know right away something you really want to see now because you're traveling soon. Uh, so traveling, uh, connections, it's always quite, quite tough, uh, you will not like the answer. Will someone look after you? Well, it all depends. There's two rules that are usually uh, across all airlines. The first one, if the delay is due to weather or cancellation due to weather, uh, in that case, uh, usually airlines will not cover you unless you are a super, super, super elite. Uh, but in that case, you don't worry because you've got all the travel insurance to look after you. But uh, bad weather, storm, de-icing, delays, in that case, unfortunately, that will not, you'll not be covered. And it doesn't mean the bad weather where you live, where you are departing. The other day the plane, the plane was delayed in Tokyo for four hours, arrived here uh, four hours later and the passengers were going to the States but um, the flight was delayed because of weather in Japan and not where we were. So uh, they were complaining but unfortunately that was weather related and they were not covered. So be very very careful, remember uh, weather can be bad anywhere on the planet and that can impact your flight. Second rule, if you have two flights that are on two different tickets, you will not be covered. You need to have everything on one single ticket and uh, even if you have two different tickets on the same airline, that will not work. So let's go in detail. You're flying from Montreal to Chicago uh, and then connecting and going to Cancun because it's winter, you would like to go to the beach, that's fair enough. Uh, your uh, flight out of Montreal was delayed and you arrive in Chicago and you have another flight with a Mexican airline. Unfortunately, uh, if the two tickets were booked separately, they will not be covered. That's why it's important to go through a travel agent. A travel agent is not someone who just know how to go on the best website to book tickets. They have a whole education, usually they have a kind of degree to be a travel agent and get licensed. So they will know all the rules that exist and then you might not know. Uh, if you don't want to go and visit a travel agent, there's some that are online like Expedia, Travel City, there's quite a few websites and the tickets that you book on those websites will have all the security that you need. But if you go straight directly on the airline's website, they will book you uh, on their own flight or on their partner's flight, but they will not give you access to all the airline that exists. So that's a little bit more restrictive, but you might want to do so, it's really up to you. So if you go through a proper travel agent and your flight out of Montreal is delayed, then you'll, unless it's weather related and you will be covered, you will be put on the next available flight. And if it's the next day, you will have um, a hotel provided so you don't have to sleep on the floor in the airport. If you have booked uh, even with the same airline, let's say you're flying United from Montreal to Chicago and continue on United from Chicago to Cancun, but on two different tickets. First, it means you have to collect your bags in Chicago and then recheck them in and then we go through security, which is pain, but also you will not be covered because there are actually two different contracts. The first one got you to Chicago, maybe late, but still get in Chicago, and then the airline will say, well, it's not our problem that you arrive late for the second flight, it's a different contract, and you miss your plane, sorry, you have to buy a new ticket. So it's important that everything is on the same ticket. Uh, if you really don't have a choice, make sure you have a lot of time in between, uh, and maybe use this time to treat yourself. Many airports now start to offer uh, spa, uh, so you can have a massage, some will have like proper spa and you can get in a bath and get uh, exfoliating stuff and everything, so get a facial, treat yourself, uh, maybe if you don't have access to lounges buy a uh, one time pass access, some, uh, some lounges do so, and then you can relax a little bit more, there's going to be food, there's going to be something to drink, you will get power for your phone so you won't drain your battery because you die, you're so bored and be on Facebook for four hours and have no more battery for the rest of the flight. Uh, treat yourself, that's a good time, especially if you're going on holiday. And my last advice is make sure you've got travel insurance. It's very important, I say so probably on like quite a few videos, but um, your credit card might be covering you, but make sure you check what's covered. Not all credit cards are the same. Usually the cheapest credit card you will get limited coverage. The travel credit card will have much more. Uh, it's a good thing to read it before you leave and also to keep this PDF contract uh, within your laptop or tablet. So if something happened, well, you can go and access it right away and you know exactly what's covered. And if they cover the hotel, they don't 
bother lining up at the airport uh, for the airline to book a hotel for you, just get this one, you pay for it and you can claim it, so you'll save some time. Uh, and um, you know exactly who to contact if you have any questions. And that's it, that's a quick video of today. Uh, if you are traveling soon, if you like the video, or if you have any stories that happened to you and you miss your connection or the airline didn't look after you, feel free to comment, put them in the comments below. If you know someone's gonna travel very soon, you can also share this video. And then uh, again, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next week, bye.